world's worst reality show will be joining us in don't forget this thursday me and will are going to be doing virtual improv all stars it's going to be fun you can get tickets to that gary dobson are you not joining us uh, i'm on the thursday after are you on next week you're next week yeah, whatever man i'm the 10th We'll be pining for you, um, but this week is going to be our second last show, so you hope to join us and get tickets over at Ticket Spice. Uh, check out all the social medias, it'll be good. But uh, we'll be back next Monday with Monday Night Improv, totally free as always, but let's finish it off with one more sexy little game, and it's World's Worst Reality TV Show. Everyone loves reality TV shows, or did love them in 1997 when they suddenly became a thing, and they never fucked off so here we are again uh have you watched the the cruise have you watched all these type of things let's go through so feel free to join us in the comments world's worst reality tv show who would like to start anyone got a belter um i'll tell you what why don't you start us off mr stuart murphy sure welcome ladies and gentlemen to another episode of birth distance <laughs> we take six pregnant women grease up the floors in front of them and as the babies <laughs> pop out we see how far they travel how much grease is being used what are the odds place your bets now can they beat last week's winning baby distance of 19 feet before the umbilical snapped <laughs> we will see you after the break brought to you by frosties bloody hell he's still going he's still going he's still wow. going jeff he's still going he's still going <laughs> Okay, world's worst reality show. Uh, oh, here's one for fans of Star Trek. Okay. Why not join us this evening as we follow Gul Dukat and his family during the occupation of Bajor as they attempt to kick a football in the air as often as possible without it touching the ground. <laughs> Do that. Is that's keepy up with the Kardashians tonight yeah. at eight <laughs> thirty. How dare you? How dare you? Like How... Pair jokes. Mic drop. <laughs> Mic drop. You're but welcome, it's... world. It sounds quite good. It sounds quite good. Uh, all, all right. Keep... <laughs> yeah. Well, up next, we're going to be looking at some of the hottest prodigy violin players in the Western world in this week's edition of Kevin Fiddlers. <laughs> <laughs> Seems fine. Seems fine. Don't see the problems. Mary Lane. Hi, hi, and welcome to Shetland Television, which is just me sitting in your room speaking to you while you sit on the couch. Anyway, tonight we have our first <laughs> of three reality TV programmes, and this one is a game show where all these folk come together and stay in a house with cameras watching them and each week folk get voted out and there's only one left and it's a Shetland version it's big brother, uncle, cousin, father, son <laughs> 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 oh, World's worst reality TV show Hello and welcome to America's next top Doddle, we'll find the slowest walkers in America, those holding up crosswalks all over the states. Tune in! Brilliant. <laughs> Hello and welcome to another episode of Farmer Llama Drama. <laughs> hey, three llamas who are used to being raised on a farm put wigs on them and then make them, we force them to act out scenes from Jane Austen's books. Brought to you by Frost. <laughs> <laughs> love it great world's worst reality show hey guys here's one for fans of star trek not for fuck's sake <laughs> join us at 9 30 as we follow the day-to-day -day comings and goings of uh -huh. the prostitute who was who was hired to service lavar burton's character during the <laughs> filming of star trek that's Geordie's whore at 9 30. <laughs> God! God! Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus up, Christ. Shut up, James. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. That hit me harder than the car. <laughs> what? It hit harder than the car. <laughs> Did Will uh, just hit James with the car? Oh, I, I think good. he might have driven through the fucking wall. Uh, 
Uh, uh, I forgot what I was going to do. <laughs> Bam! Things are getting sexy. Things are getting furry. Things are getting glittery. Woof! Look at him go on this week's edition of RuPaul's Dog Race. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, hi, and welcome back to Shetland Television. We've all had a pity break where he went through into the cup of tea and spoke with the weather, but now it's time for the second reality, real TV television program of the night. And tonight we have a show where it's quite exciting. We've shipped eight figure skaters up for suit on the boat, and we teamed them up with a local celebrities, for councillors, local councillors, to... Uh, stars of Shetland, because mind Maggie was in the background walking past in the scene one time, and everyone's favourite person, the postman. Anyway, it'll all be paired out of ice skaters and dancing in the only venue we could fin. That's right, Magnus Bayer. It's dancing on shite. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. World's worst reality TV show. Hello and welcome. Big Brother is no longer airing. We now have Big Sister. It is a show where some random girl listens to all of your conversations, finds out your secrets, and tells them to your mum. <laughs> oh, just a nerve there, I think. World's worst reality TV show. Fuck it, I'll do it myself. Some people get get bored while waiting on the NHS waiting list for a vasectomy. We give them three litres of vodka and a selection of rusty knives. How long will they be able to hold out? What kind of job will they do? Do they really want to have not have kids that bad? Brought to you by Frosty. <laughs> they are sponsoring a lot of TV just now. They are they sponsoring are. a lot they of are. TV just now. They need it. Oh, I, I, I've got one. Um, particularly for anyone <laughs> who, who might be interested in Star Trek. <laughs> Last one, I swear to fuck, man. Swear to Join fuck. us. Come on. Join us. I dare you. <laughs> Join us as we follow Kiko O'Brien, Lita, <laughs> and Jennifer Sisko as they go about their everyday lives as botanist, dabble girl, and dead person. That's right. Tonight at 10.30, it's the Real Housewives of Deep Space Nine, because I was running out of ideas. Hi, Billy. Billy's yeah. gone to vomit in anger. <laughs> I'd like to apologise to any Star Trek fans watching. Although realistically, we all need content for it, so it's probably probable they're going to happen. I've never yeah. seen a car run out of petrol when it was going downhill before. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it was speeding just... towards inevitable disaster and then just stopped on a downward I, grade. I couldn't, I couldn't stop it too. I had to have a third. Of course. Of course. Uh, oh. Up next, Deirdre is, speak, is screaming at a spoon and David appears to be slamming meringues up his arsehole. It's Great British Bake Off, the fucking <laughs> idiot's edition. <laughs> <laughs> Why on earth would you? That's not how you make a trifle, <laughs> but David doesn't care. He's just scraping off his skin flakes onto a board, <laughs> hoping for the best. And while well, Alison is screaming into some haunted parchment. <laughs> You. New Dane. So we've slipped the coos out to the hill, so it's time for the late night programming before we fall asleep in our chairs at the television. And the last show is a show about couples getting married. But you see, these 18 year old contestants, we've paired up. They get married, and then we see how they get on in their married life, not knowing who they're going to marry before. We got all the 18 year olds we could in the island. Ah, six of them, and this is married at 27,000th and 813th time of sight. <laughs> <laughs> World's worst reality TV show. Hello and welcome to Heaven's Kitchen. Forget a shouting Gordon Ramsay, no one getting their meal and lots of stress. In this restaurant, you get your meal on time and there's a two-for-one deal on. 
<laughs> any more for any more guys Stu? welcome to another edition of i'm a celebrity get me out of leah it's where we get <laughs> my celebrity and put them into a live production of king's king <laughs> shakespeare company they don't know the lines they don't get the references they've never even read a book Sponsored by Trusty. <laughs> wow. I've got I've I've got I've got one that could actually be a real one coming to Amazon Prime this fall. Uh it's uh, behind the scenes at the US Apprentice, uh during which uh which follows Donald Trump as he repeatedly uses the N-word, calls people retarded, and acts like the obnoxious shit box of a man that he actually is. <laughs> Yes, it's the real reason Jeff Bezos paid nine million for MGM when it's only valued at five million. That's tonight at eleven. That's it, coming to Amazon Prime in the fall. It's Jeff Bezos's four billion middle four billion dollar middle finger to Trump. That could actually happen because he now owns all the entertainment. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. And that was me just going and coming up next. Goodbye. Forty minutes of dogs stretching. Oh, oh good boy. Oh, good boy. Big stretch. Big stretch. Oh. You know, human beings get really annoyed when you say that, when you see them stretching and you go, oh, big stretch. They get really annoyed. They get really yeah. annoyed. Oh, it's a, it's a good boy. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs> Next up, another episode of I Can Make It. 40 minutes of middle-aged men getting out of a chair. <laughs> <laughs> Will anything be heard to click? Brought to you by Cocoa Puff. Uh, any more for any more? Looks like all I can, uh, literally I'm stunned nobody did a pedos about one, but I'm delighted at the same one. <laughs> <way. laughs> pedos about did and just a thing. Your mate is probably somewhere shouting it at the screen. I want to fuck this <laughs> <laughs> reality show. Um, bless, bless him. Oh yeah. There's one. There's one for Stu. Are you ready for this one? You read this one, yeah. Stu. Yes, please. Up next, wank wedding. Oh, wedding. <laughs> hey. TWW, now, up next. Unfortunately, there's no time to explain to Natalie what the context of that is. I don't she need just to know. No, you just <laughs> know the kind of guy who will wank three times if you invite me to your wedding. Hi. <laughs> yeah. I got... uh, we, the, next week on uh, on Nami Lookalike, uh, the, 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 the returning winner from last week, a dismissive cheese string, takes on all the <laughs> Oh, I got one. Oh, go on then. Howdy, it's me, Rootin' Tootin'. And <laughs> I've been going around locations trying to find my horse. It's kind of like location, 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 but it fell down in a watering hole, so it's called Well, Well, Well. Yes. <laughs> That's Rootin' uh, Tootin' right, Pistachio. Right. Hang on, oh, I've, got, I've, I've, got one, I've got one response to that. Hmm. Well, I wouldn't make fun of you lot. I would just have a show <laughs> called... Friends. Somewhere <laughs> <laughs> in this flat, I've got a Ventolin inhaler in a glass of Pims. <laughs> uh, I, I'm told at the moment Will is just rolling people out of their iron lungs. That's the reason he's not here tonight. <laughs> oh, right. right. Uh, uh, I, hello, I, I'm Will Nami, and I, I've I've got a show. Um, my show is a show. Uh, it's called. Uh, it's called. <laughs> um, uh, oh, it's called Blind Date, and it's Blind Date, and it's where I go on a date, but I'm blindfolded, and everyone looks at me and runs away, and I'm on my own, and then I whip into my pillow at night. With sparrows. <laughs> <laughs> With my tiny cock. Tiny cock. Well, yeah. Will's latest rap video has just been retweeted by Dawn French, so when he leaves us for some oh, reason, fuck we've him. only fuck ourselves him. to blame. Wow. Wow, well, we had a good run. Will was always my favourite. I just want to put that on record. Hi, I'm I'm Will, and this is my other show. It's it was where I rap on stage and show off my talents. It's like the X Factor, but it's me saying on stage, so it's just a <laughs> it's just a lowercase L factor. As far as I'm. Well, I hope, <laughs> Lane, I hope you two kids could just sort this the fuck out because this is this is getting angry. This is we, this is getting this is getting dirty now. It was all fun, yeah. have, but he's the one getting retweeted by. Fuck each other, okay? Because the <laughs> sexual tension is unbearable and it's beginning to bleed into the show. Are you, are you, are you talking Fuck to me? Fuck it out, kid. <laughs> I'll talk to him me? like I talk to my accountant. Get it done. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> on that note, ladies and gentlemen, we will see you next Monday. Give it up for our special guest, Miss Natalie Bryce. You can follow her on Twitter, Instagram, and all good places. Make sure to check out Marilyn Streams, phrasing on that. Well, Nami, uh, of course, you can check him out. He's been retweeted now by Don French, uh, all the, uh, which is amazing. And, of course, we'll be back with Virtual Improv All-Stars on Thursday. We'll be back here next Monday. Look after yourselves, motherfuckers. Bye! Ah. You wanna do something?